Line looks pretty good. Bit three, six, five, odds drift, light on set. Gates open, away they go. Little Town Blues was one of the first to break out from the middle of the line. Obligatory begins well, and so does Smart Cap the inside. So plenty want to be right there on the speed settling down. Noble War just gets out of it with Blue Ant and Thunder Peak, the mare, she'll drop out the back. So Little Town Blues at the nine went through for Wayne Davis and sets up the speed. Two lengths to Smart Cap now as they find their order. Noble War went the third. Blue Ant's a little bit wide, but on the improve. Over on the inside, Obligatory just drifting back for Nichols and tacking on there, Thunder Peak, and starting to improve. So it's Little Town Blues inside the six, the leader, shows the way to in front of Smart Cap, and then a line of four of them chasing these top two, namely on the inside, Obligatory, Thunder Peak's deep out, Noble War, Blue Ant, they need to get a move on before the turn, where Little Town Blues makes play, comes around the turn, two in front. Smart Cap gets off its back to go out after it, a gap, Obligatory tries to come on, and deeper out, Thunder Peak, the leader, Little Town Blues, but Smart Cap's coming on, it's Little Town Blues at the 150, the leader looks to be holding Smart Cap for the moment. Obligatory got to a clear third, but yes, Little Town Blues coming away late, and Little Town Blues all too strong. Little Town Blues down to the line by two and a half to three to Obligatory, who got up the run second in front of Smart Cap, and then Thunder Peak, well back Noble War, and Blue Ant the last one home. Nice win there all the way, Little Town Blues. Wayne Davis, Phil Cole posting a winner on today's card. Back in winning form. Strung together a few wins here back last season and today just got the lead and kept them rolling along in a race which was pretty hard to sort of work out but Little Town Blues fresh up to a degree. Had the, uh, a couple of runs in Alice Springs, oh, in fact a couple of runs sorry in Darwin just of recent times behind Poupay and that form looks very strong and just finds this a touch better this afternoon in the form of number one Little Town Blues finding it a touch easier. Smart cap and obligatory with obligatory working home late on the outside. Smart cap up on speed. And uh, the margin there a fair bit by the time we got back to the remainder. 10947 the time, won the winner, Little Town Blues, a four year old bay going exceed and excel truly wicked. Rhonda Cold, Brendan Walding in the ownership with D. O'Brien. B. O'Brien, uh, Michael Newman in the ownership with J. L. Newman, Jess Newman in the ownership with R. M. Satrowski. S. Clancy, B.J. Thompson, Mrs. J.K. Murray, Jill Bournes in the ownership with the Tropical Thunder Syndicate, managed by G. Lewis, K.I. Schulte, or Reichstein, P. Uh, Paul Meekins there with P.M. Cole, Mrs. M. Corbett Weir, J. Busby, and Mrs. S.J. Holburn, trained by Phil Cole and Wayne Davis. And it'll return shortly at start number... Only 13's had the four wins, three minors, and that win will take its prize money now up towards the $85,000 mark. And WD, he was down at Tennant Creek last week, and uh, he's uh, been doing the Alice of Springs, of course, booting a few home here and there, and uh, post one on today's card. Second goes to two obligatory, four-year-old Bay Gorning, fast net rock necessary, Gary Clark, Paul Size, and third to five, smart cap, five-year-old Brown Mayor, Capiro, Waraderi for Nicole Lowe and Vanessa Arnott in front of six, got fourth, Thunder Peak. Fifth went to four, Noble War. We stand by for all clear.